Tank. We are back here. <laughs> Man, look how I come around, though. Look how I come around, though. I just can't get away from Easy Meal. That's the first thing. I cannot get away from Easy Meal. But, you know, this was sent to my Instagram, and I couldn't miss this. I couldn't miss my boy, Mr. L. Boyd, over here crying about copyrights on YouTube reactions. <laughs> wow. Man, let's get straight into it. All right, guys. I don't know how we have have lasted this long, right? But we have, miraculously, we, we definitely have. Uh, Pandering. Um, We've been since the beginning to to 481,900 subscribers, guys. Shout out to you for that. That's a big deal. That's a big deal. Oh, uh, it's tough to get there, you know, even with pandering, it's tough to get there unless you cheesing, but that's a story for another day. Congratulations, Mr. L Boy. Um from zero to that with not a single copyright strike. Not a copyright claim. We get those every day. But copyright strikes, the ones that actually get your channel taken down, right? Um that has happened to not just me to a lot of other YouTubers who are now most likely checking their emails if they reacted to the person I will mention soon. Okay. Keep in mind, this guy, when he started out, he was not. Oh, what's up all the build up? His name right in the title. Easy meal. What, what is this? Like a fucking breakup and y'all in love or something. This is kind of weird. Famous. Someone heard a song from him and it immediately blew up. Right. Then everyone started reacting to his content. Then everyone started pulling all of his other music, right? And reacting to everything because he was such a phenomenon to begin with, right? It's such a shame because we absolutely enjoyed his content. But he has now sent out takedown notices, um, copyright strike notices, right? For the removal of videos basically no problem we'll remove them right because again it's our channel no problem okay so what you crying about channel right he's basically there for, for the most part he's holding all of our channels hostage we help him he he then in response holds all of our channels hostage guys what's that what is that well, what is that? How is Easy Meal holding your channel hostage? I'm so confused. Oh, um, did I mention artist? Oh, no, I didn't. I probably didn't. I don't know, guys. Um, his name is Easy Mill, Ez Mill, Easy Mill, right? Um, the the guy who who, who took over the the internet uh, a little little uh, a little less than maybe a year ago. He took over the the internet, guys. Phenomenon out of nowhere, blown up by reaction channels online who prom freely promoted his music. Stop right there. Oh my God. You can tell how sensitive and emotional this nigga is. You trying to flip the script and play the victim role? Like, and you just trying to, you are wrong. You are wrong. And I got to take up for easy meal on this. I can't believe this, but what? Reaction channels blew him up? Um, I think that he blew up a lot of reaction channels. Like, how y'all blew him up? Obviously, y'all reacting to him for a reason. Um, y'all can't just pick some street dude off the street and blow him up because y'all reacting to him. It don't always work like that. You just said he was a phenomenon. Everybody enjoy his music. I didn't, but I guess y'all clowns faked it or whatever the case. Either way, I'm sure that y'all helped him less than he helped y'all channels. Like, I'm confused. So now reaction channels blow up the artists. So again, I guess Eminem um, needed y'all help too. So all the reaction channels, no, 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 no. Y'all help Eminem blow up bigger instead of Eminem helping y'all blow up bigger. Like what? I can't believe you just tried that shit. That's so like corny for you to even try to flip the script like that. No, nigga, Easy Meal helped y'all. Y'all didn't help him that much. And you saying for free. Um, y'all got paid for that shit. 
Y'all got paid for that shit. When I first did Easy Mail, it was no copyright claim on it. The video, I got paid for that shit. Guess what? I still never did another one because I don't fuck with them and I don't want to hear them no more. So I never did another one, but we got paid for that. So what are you talking about? Uh, it's just like, you just cry, baby. You trying to play the victim role and flip the script. You acting like a damn female. Okay. A couple of months after that, he he started copyright claiming all of the reactions that we did, right? Um, meaning that we, we, we did all this work promoting him. Then he turned around and said, for the most part, if you make anything off of this video, which would be most likely not a lot of money at all, right? Generally, it's not a lot. But like, you, if you make anything off this video, it's now mine. So all of the equipment, time, effort you put into making that specific piece of content, I'm going to take it. It's his. He made the song. You didn't make the song. You didn't sit nowhere and write those lyrics in the kitchen. Even though there was trash, Easy Meal wrote those. He earned that. What you mean? Like, so you think that because you as a reaction channel edit videos, put in the time that you just, <laughs> wow. I don't know if he's serious like, or he's just that delusional. You come across like a smart guy, like man, very articulate, but you can't be this dumb to think that because you put time in, you could just use whatever the fuck you want and all the money goes to you. That's not how copyright works. He put in a copyright claim. At first of all, it wasn't him. He actually signed a record label. The record label gets the copyright claims. That's how this works. Let me break it down to you. So a record label pays an artist up front, like advancement or something like that. But on the back end, they making their money back by what? Uh, residuals, royalties, uh, YouTube, all type of stuff like that, right? So the record company is trying to make their money back because they own that music. First of all, it's not easy meal. So this whole heartbroken thing that you got against him, you aiming at the wrong person. It's not him. Uh, he did what he's supposed to do. He was independent. He started blowing up. He got a record deal. Now the record label is doing what they're supposed to do. Uh, they're getting paid for the investment that they made on their artists. And you got a big chocolate ass, ugly ass nigga crying about it like you are old something. Nigga, you ain't old shit. You not in the music business. You a fat ass YouTuber who just sit there in a racing chair and sweat for 30 minutes. And, and you trying to get paid for other people's music. That's crazy. That is crazy. Couldn't be me. Anything I do that was copyrighted in the past, obviously I know it go to the artist. Never crying about it. Now, um, I did have a copyright strike situation this week. I mean, I got copyright striked to hell, to hell. And it's like, oh, fuck. Like, um, shit. And guess what? I just seen that it gave you seven days to take yours down or something like that. Me, I didn't get no seven days, nothing. It was an instant copyright strikes, multiple. And guess what? I hold nothing against the artist. I say who it is. It's Snow the Product. So I had to take down all my Snow the Product reactions because, like I say, it's just going to get my channel terminated if I, like, do more or something like that. So, you know, it's cool and I get it. But, like I say, I love Snow the Product. Great rapper, great lyricist. I fuck with her. I'm not going to hold no grudge against her because of that. She trying to get her money, the record label, trying to get their money. Life ain't fair, my nigga. Like, 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 this is reality. He's sitting there crying like a little bitch, though. That's what he said, basically in his head. I'm taking everything from every single channel that freely promoted me. <sighs> it's not freely promoted shit. What, what are you talking about? Freely promoted like y'all know what y'all was doing y'all was eating off his name over and over and over again y'all was getting paid for it y'all was getting views y'all was getting subscribers y'all was using easy meal well no free promotion stop that man we not all dumb is what he's saying then now to then I, when that happened i i literally had to stop reacting to him um because of that specific thing because because you wasn't getting paid for artist work. So let me guess, 
You don't do no artists who sign because they all getting paid for it. What you talking about? You had to stop because his record label start claiming his music that they worked for. You didn't. Because I was like the disrespect, the behind the scenes disrespect, right? Now, don't get me wrong. There are a couple of artists on YouTube who, who have a, you know, a very public persona that is great, right? But then like behind the scenes, it's the exact opposite, it seems. Um, so this channel absolutely was attacked by uh, his management company. Um, and so so he's basically done out here. Uh, for me personally, on this channel, he is gone. Um, the, and all of his videos will, will be removed from this channel. Um, so that's a thing also, right? Um, and I'm not the only one. Let's test that. Let's test that. Mr. L. Boyd, Easy Meal. Uh, you got one Easy Meal, two Easy Meal, Easy Meal, Easy Meal. That's Cap. That's Cap. One, and that that's the thing. So it would have been smarter if his management team emailed the channels directly and been like, please take this song down. All of us would have obliged, but instead you say, you have seven days to remove this so your channel's gonna get a copyright strike. Same thing, what's the difference? He's saying take it down, he's saying take it down. It's too harsh, your feelings hurt because he gave you seven days, uh, but if you would've asked nicely, you would've just did it, uh, do it anyway. Quit being sensitive for. Uh, it definitely ain't Matt, Knight, and Crook. Nah, it definitely ain't. I don't know what you're talking about, but nah, it ain't. Really? You're done out here, bro. All right? Nigga, he not done. You done. You crying. He done because he trash, but it, it, it look like you done. You pressed. He ain't. Um, but all right. Yeah, so guys, uh, no, absolutely no easy meal content under under any circumstance or his management uh, or anything from or any of the artists that his management uh, looks at. The name of the management company is uh, FFP Records and Management. So any of these... Anything from, from that management company? No, thank you. Uh, and definitely anything from Easy Mail? Absolutely no, thank you. Because this is the second time that he has personally, for the most part, attacked this channel. All right? So, um, yeah, guys. Enjoy your days. Attack. That's crazy, man. Gave you seven days. If you take it down, nothing happens. So within those seven days, just take it down and go on with your life. You so hurt. Now, I ain't going to lie. In my case, I wish somebody would have gave me seven days. They got, it, it was a instant. Like Snow the Product and, and her videos. Oh, my God. It's instant. Guess what? No seven days. Like, it don't matter if you take it down or not. It was just instant. Copyright strike. You know? Like I say, it is what it is. I got the time stone. I will go back in time and remove this shit. So I'm not tripping. I'm just watching this shit play out. <laughs> like, like, none of this shit affects me. It don't bother me. But, of course, it's going to be tough to do Snow the Product, you know. Maybe I'll do it anyway and just see what happened. But, you know, uh, theirs is real strict, you know. On her side, it's kind of it's like real strict. And I had a lot of Snow the Product videos, so I got, like, like, like I said, I got striked to hell. So right now, I ain't about to be doing no copyright for a while. Give me like a month or something where I'd be petty and just hate on people for a month or something. Then I get back to, or if I do reactions, it's going to be like some independent or some radio reactions or something, you know. I got to do something different to where, um, you know, my channel stay up. Or I could try to do some shit on my second channel or something. But no, we, uh-uh, we going to oblige. I got you. You know, I, I'm having fun on YouTube right now. No, 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 don't delete my channel yet. We going to oblige right now. But I, like I say, I'm not pressed about it. I'm not mad at no artist or they record company. This right here, boy, you so damn sweaty over this shit. Yeah. Left your ass on red. YouTube, what is up? Y'all already know who it is, man. We don't know who it is. Who the fuck is this? We don't know who it is. Dysfunctional TV. Uh, first of all, fuck you. I didn't. I, I don't know you. You light skin. I don't fuck with you. 
Uh, other than that, oh man, this was like an eye opener for like me to know that it's like grown men out here who act like whiny, spoiled, entitled brats. Like, I don't think people understand reality. Like I say, what you thought was reality was not reality. Nigga, this is the real world. It don't work like that. You can't get mad because you was getting something for free. You should be happy because you even got it for a year for free. You know, you should be happy about that. Oh, uh, I've been got the got the copyright claim on my one easy meal video. I didn't give a fuck. I never mentioned nothing about it. You know, it's still up. I don't care. Let easy meal get his money off his work that he created. You know, like what the fuck? Entitled motherfucker, man. Oh man. I I'm I'm starting to feel sick to my stomach. Like even thinking about this shit, man. ether is fluid and ever-changing. It changes matter into dark matter. It seeks out host bodies, drawing strength from their life force. Alakith sought to use the ether's power to return the universe to one of darkness. 